So, what was your husband addicted to, or what drug did he do? Um, crack cocaine. Okay. So, how long did he do that? You know, I don't know. I was thinking, and I'm trying to think. I think he told me in 1990 that he was on drugs. Okay. So, it was probably proved before then? I don't know how long. Did you know um, when he stopped? Yeah, um, in 2013. Okay, so how, as being, were y'all married the, the whole time? Mm -hmm. Okay, how did you hold the family together? Well, I didn't have no choice, you know, I had two children that I had to take care of. So I just did the best I can. I was in church, so that made a difference to me. And plus, I didn't really understand, you know, the thing about drugs. All I know that God could heal him if he wanted to. That was my thing. That he didn't have to be that way. But I felt like it was a choice. And of course, like everybody else say, they don't think that they have a problem, you know. But to me, it tied tied me in is almost being on drugs too because it, you know, it it hinders the family. How did you try to shield your children from that lifestyle, if you could? Um. Well, he wasn't at home most of the time. You know, he would be away from home. But I guess they learned about it, you know, from friends and stuff like that, because you know how people talk. So we went on with life as normal, but of course, it, you know, it bothered us. How did that put a strong strain on y'all's relationship and marriage? Well, it put a, a big strain on the relationship and marriage as far as I was concerned, you know, because he was out there and he wasn't responsible, you know, for me and the children. So you tend to, um, you feel the hurt and the pain. So what made you stay with them? I was committed to my marriage. And I did know you know, the bottom line that God could save him. Even though he was so that he was so tied up in it that I really didn't believe that God was gonna save him. But he did in the end. Um but I I knew I had to stay, you know, keep my head on for my children. I had to make sure that they were okay. Thank you. You're welcome.